Good to see you, champ. Congratulations on your big win against Cody at the Rumble. Huh. <laughs> Feels good to finally quiet the critics. Indeed. And good to have you back here on Raw 2. Although last time you visited, it ended with me sporting a black eye. Ah, it was a heated moment and you got caught in the crossfire. Sorry about that. We good? I've been in this business for 40 years. If I cut ties with everyone who's punched me in the face, I'd have no friends. I'm glad we can move past that and focus on what's next. Don't you mean, who's next? Since you're holding all the gold, you'll be facing the winner of last night's Royal Rumble match, Montez Ford. I've been wanting to mix it up with him for years. WrestleMania is going to be huge when I tear the house down with Ford and tie Roman's record. Well, we're going to give the WWE Universe a preview of WrestleMania when you and Montez have a little chat in the ring tonight. Let's do this. The newly crowned double champion is here on Raw to kick off the road to WrestleMania. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct pleasure to introduce to you the undisputed WWE Universal World Heavyweight Champion. That's quite a mouthful, champ. I agree. Maybe we'll just call him the undisputed champion from now on. Well, hello there, Raw! <laughs> it's pretty damn cool to be back where I started, but on a whole different level. Speaking of reaching a whole new level, I'm not the only guy who had a good night at the Royal Rumble. See, there's a man who's got a WrestleMania main event to cash in, a superstar who's ready to make the leap. Honestly, he reminds me a bit of myself from a few years back. So let me introduce you to this year's winner of the Royal Rumble match, Montez Ford! Oh, we're gonna see it now. The two biggest dogs in the yard are gonna face off. Both these men look ready to go. Well, they're gonna have to wait until WrestleMania. It's a mutual respect between Ford and the champion. What's this? It's not the best time for technical difficulties. It's Roman Reigns! This guy will not let our champion celebrate a single moment. Undisputed, huh? Look at you, peacocking around like you mean something. That title you took from Cody at the Rumble? They made it up because nobody could beat me. I am so tired of hearing people compare you to me. Are you so deluded that you really think I would let a pretender like you Time my record with the Universal title? Nah. Mm -mm. Come on. You shouldn't even be there. Montez Ford! You're a young man with a bright future. I'm sorry to say this, but you're not the guy I can count on to beat this clown at Mania. So there's been a change of plans. See? What I did is I took a big briefcase full of my Hollywood money, flew in my private jet out to the woods of Minnesota, and I hired myself a hunter who knows a little something about ending streaks at Mania. Hope it was fun while it lasted. Chill. What? The beast! 
Priest is back! Montez Ford isn't going to roll over for anyone. Here we go. F5 on the stage from Brock. Ford is hurt. But here comes the champion. No, Solo Sokoa. Has the bloodline reunited? It certainly looks that way. Brock Lesnar just broke Ford's arm. Regal trying to restore some order. Stereo super kicks right to the GM's jaw. No, they have to stop. Regal's not a competitor anymore. Welcome to Suplex City, champ. Montez Ford is down. Regal is down. Dark Horse is down. Who can stop Brock Lesnar and the Bloodline? The reunited Bloodline and Brock are working together to break the undisputed champion before he can make it to WrestleMania. And the champ can't do a damn thing about it. Isn't this great? Roman's brilliant plan put Regal in the hospital. So there's no debate now. Who's the best GM in WWE? It's me! You are the picture of class, Miz. I have exactly zero patience for you or any of this. I want the bloodline, and I want them now. I am generally not in the give the dark horse what he wants business. But in this case, I cannot wait to see Brock and the Bloodline break you and your big dreams of beating Roman's record at Mania. Hmm. <sighs> You're gonna be disappointed. You don't even sound sure yourself, but whatever. You wanna get the hell kicked out of you on the way to Mania? Who am I to stop the fun? Hey, I hear you're going after the Bloodline after what they did to you and Regal. I am. They're gonna get what's coming to them. Nobody knows the Bloodline better than I do. I know your story, Sammy. You don't. You only know what you saw on TV. Let me help you take them down. Sammy, I appreciate that. I do. But this is something I have to do on my own. Look, I tried to take out the Bloodline alone and it didn't work. You need backup. I owe my career to Regal. I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for him having faith in me when nobody else did. And then the bloodline tore him apart while I did nothing. Nothing. I hear you, but I'm telling you, you're making a mistake trying to do this alone. We haven't even talked about the fact that they have Brock Lesnar now. I don't have time for any of this. I'm done talking. I'm taking down the bloodline. Now. Well, I tried. Good luck, champ. You're gonna need it. With the bloodline reunited and stronger than ever, you can see the confidence in Solo Sokoa. It's the undisputed champ. He's taking a big risk if you ask me. This is our undisputed champion attacking Solo in the parking lot. What has the bloodline been up to for the past few years? This is a small taste of their own medicine. The champ better finish what he started here because what you don't want is an angry Solo Sokoa coming after you. Big forearm. Oh, walloped by a huge club. Jarring impact. Hey, 
Undertaker connects. Oh, merciless knee to the face. to the face. Big boot! <laughs> Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Uh-oh. Harlem sidekick! The champion with a hard strike. But here come the Usos. You attack one member of the bloodline, you attack them all. This could be a repeat of what happened when they reunited. And Solo with the spike. And now they're sending him up for something else. Right into the side of that car. He might be joining Regal and Montez Ford on the IR when this is over. What is Jey Uso directing them to do? It looks like the champ's about to go for a ride. Shades of the shield. No, not this. Down onto the car. The champ bit off more than he could chew. Now this guy isn't even going to make it to Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania. For the second time, the newly reformed bloodline has left our undisputed champion lying. That didn't turn out so well. <sighs> yeah, maybe you were right. There is no taking the bloodline out one at a time. There's only taking them all out in a single blow with even numbers. The Usos have a match tonight. I should strike afterwards when they least expect it. Or should I say, we? You win? Yep, but knowing how they operate, we're gonna need one more guy. You got someone in mind? I do. Let's do this. Another big win for the Usos. These guys have been on a roll ever since the Bloodline reunited. Wait, wait, it's the champ and Sami Zayn. We know his history with the bloodline. And they're taking it to the Usos. The sides have been even up, at least for now. Sami Zayn and the Undisputed Champion are getting after the Usos, sending a direct message to Roman Reigns. Actions speak louder than words, Cole, and the champ is speaking loudly. Flying! Shooting star press! That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Look at all these boots to the face. Here comes a big one. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. Oh, oh man, kick to the face. Elbow puts an end to that. A little cockiness here from Jay. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. And he's going with the great equalizer here to steal chip. Oh, there's a headbutt. Don't come over here. Cole, quick, use Saxton as a human shield. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. 
desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. And what's he looking for here? Run! He's got his head done still! Ooh, harsh kick. And sent right into the corner. Close line in the straight to the knee. Payne must be shooting through that leg now. Can he say? Take down. The coaching clutch. Well, this isn't going to win the fall, but it's going to. How's he going to get? This isn't a match. It's just a fight. Hard strikes from the champ. But here comes Solo Sokoa. Solo nails the champion with a headbutt. So much for evening the odds. The bloodline now has a three on two advantage. Not anymore. The champ and his little buddies walked the bloodline right into a trap. Sammy sends Jey Uso over the top. And there goes Jimmy. What a shot to Solo Sokoa. He got knocked right out of the ring. They jump the bloodline from behind, and then they act like they won some kind of fair fight. As soon as the sides were even, the bloodline ran for the hills. It's called a strategic retreat, Cole. The balance of power just shifted on the road to WrestleMania. You must be feeling pretty good about yourself after outsmarting the bloodline. Well, you get to keep riding that high because I have some good news for you. That would be a first. Miz has made a match. You and your two self-destructive brothers in arms are going to take on the bloodline in a no-disqualification six-man tornado tag match. Oh, you managed to get that out without looking at the note on your hand. Good job, Troy. We accept. Before we get to WrestleMania, the undisputed champion and his allies take on the reformed bloodline in a six-man tag team match. These two sides have had some vicious battles as of late, and now they're going to settle it in the ring. Nothing will truly be settled until our champion faces the beast Brock Lesnar at Mania. Then we'll see who truly comes out on top. Jay reverses. 
German suplex. But that's not all. Into a real court left of the pin. And the win. Yes. No, he gets the shoulder. How? Oh, How? Meanwhile, we have Sami Zayn. And he only stays down for a one count. That's smart. Spear. Look at Jay. His lights are off. Save. Does he get him here? Shoulder shoots up before two. He's still got life in this matchup. So right to the kidneys from behind. He's positioning himself, closing in. He eludes the contact. more than fired up right now. Intense offense, as always, from the Enforcer. And for cover here! And looking at Jey Uso. He thinks he has it! How? How? A defiant kick out after one. No time to waste being shocked. You've got to maintain pressure. And that move by a spear! That could be it! Jimmy gets intercepted. Keeps his team in the match. There! That was vicious. That's got to do it. That's got to be it. Two. Almost ended it there. Getting dangerously close to him. He may get the three count right here. I think so. Shoulder up right away. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Will be landed here. Kick it out before the count. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. And up the turn, Buckles, we go. Boom. First up top. Diving knee drop. Oh my goodness. He may get the three count right here. This is it. I can't believe it. Roman's insurance policy did not pay off. Look at the arrogance of these guys. That's not arrogance, Corey. That's pride. These guys are going to have a lot of explaining to do when the head of the table calls them into the next board meeting. Roman cannot be happy right now. Champ's ribs. Did you hear that? The Beast is on a rampage. Sheer carnage from Brock. At least he dropped the chair. No, 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 no. F5 onto the steel chair. The undisputed champion is hurt. What kind of shape is he going to be in this Saturday at WrestleMania? Reigns' plan didn't fail after all. We forgot about his newest associate. Roman's record is secure. All hail our next undisputed champion, Brock Lesnar. Walking wounded have arrived. I'm honestly surprised you made it, after what Brock did to you and your friends last week. Three plus years, Miz. I'd think you would have learned about doubting me by now. Tonight, those doubts finally come true. I tried to warn you years ago. 
that this would end in tears. That you would come this close in getting out of Roman's shadow and failed at the finish line is going to eat you up for the rest of your life. You know the definition of insanity, right? Repeating the same action again and again, expecting different results. So what? So that's you underestimating me and having it blow up in your face every time. Not this time. Not against Brock Lesnar. I'm going to paint you a picture. I keep my titles tonight, tying Roman's universal record. Then tomorrow, I watch night two of Mania with my feet up in a skybox as the clock strikes midnight and I beat Roman's record. No! Yes, Miz. Yes. And then, on SmackDown, you are going to have the honor of introducing me as the longest reigning Universal Champion in WWE history. I guarantee you, that will not happen. One day, one more day, and the undisputed champion goes in the history books, tying Roman Reigns' title run. One day? I thought you meant that the champ has one more day on Earth. After all, he is running head on into a buzzsaw named Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar is no stranger to beating streaks at WrestleMania. Will the champion reign supreme and make history? Or will the Beast devour another opponent, cutting short their glory on the grandest stage of them all? Ooh. gonna hurt. Into a crushing forearm. That's gonna do it. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. The challenger's looking shaken. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Wicked clothesline. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. And this one might be headed ringside. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Brock must be phased after this string of action. Brock needs to find a way to reverse his fortunes. This match is spilled out to the ringside area, and as we can see, tension's really running high now. Oh, uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. The referee counted, urging them to get in the ring. The challenger is not in a great place. Yeah, but you can't count. Launching. Five star frog splash. He just isn't being given any room to recuperate. Yeah, and this has to decrease his composure moving forward. Soaring, shooting star press. Taking a chance one more time and landing with incredible impact. A oh, costly error there. Double axe handle. He's got him in the crosshairs. Superman punch. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Spear. Now that is why there's a champ. Cover! Two count? No, no, not now. I don't believe it. How did the 
challengers survived that? By the skin of their teeth. And don't expect the champ to start going easy on them now. I can see it in the eyes from here. Disbelief. Unbelievable how this one is still going. Watch out. Cross body to the floor. Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. Returning to the ring now. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. Running knee lift. Rock here now. Not used to being without the momentum. You don't see Lesnar flustered. Here we go. Oh, and he doesn't connect. Denied with an elbow. Spin! Man, earth shattering. I think the champ's got it. For the win! Two! He's done it! He's done it! By the end of WrestleMania weekend, the undisputed champion will have tied Roman Reigns' record-setting yeah. reign with the WWE Universal title. I can't believe it. It's about time you started to believe. Not this. Roman Reigns interrupting the champion's moment again at WrestleMania. You know what, Roman? I don't want to hear it. You've been doing this for three years now. Instead of, what is it you're doing? Celebrity guest host on some game show? Shilling your new NFT? Or maybe, just maybe, you're filming another cameo in a failing sequel. Don't know what to say without a script? I'll help you out. The only table you're the head of anymore is the one that Rock brushes his crumbs onto. I'm here. I'm doing the work. And the only thing... I'm sure you got a lot to say, but it doesn't matter. When you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. Roman Reigns! After years away in Hollywood, the head of the table is back! The entire WWE Universe is in shock! Unbelievable! Hope you're not too busy tomorrow night, champ. Because the landlord is back. And rent is due. Do we have a new WWE Universal Championship match set for night two of WrestleMania? This is unprecedented. The undisputed champ might as well kiss breaking Roman's record goodbye. Kayla, night one of WrestleMania was an incredible experience, but all of the focus now is on what happened after the undisputed champion defeated Brock Lesnar. That's right, Byron. Roman Reigns made a shocking return by laying out the champion right after his successful main event defense. The dark horse slayed the beast, but immediately fell to the head of the table. Roman Reigns then issued a challenge for tonight. And the undisputed champ accepted. For the first time in WrestleMania history, one superstar will be main eventing both nights. In addition to Charlotte Flair's huge women's world championship defense against Gigi Dolan, the WWE Universal title will be on the line. The undisputed champ will defend against Roman Reigns, who stated that his only interest is taking back his Universal title. At midnight tonight, whichever man wins will walk out the longest reigning WWE Universal Champion in history. Get ready for history to be made on night two of WrestleMania.
You made it! I told you. I wouldn't miss this for the world. How are you feeling? You ready? You know, I've been getting the hell beat out of me for days, my ribs ache so bad it hurts to breathe, and not knowing Miz, I'm sure I'll have something up his sleeve. Typical Sunday night, then? Pretty much. I'd give you the full Churchill, but I don't think you need inspirational speeches anymore. No? You're a champion. Twice over. You've more than fulfilled your potential, so I'll save the pretty words for the next kid coming up. Thanks, Regal. For everything. Congratulations, champ. Thanks. I said I was gonna go to Raw and win their title, and that's what I did. And now it's your turn to deliver. You want out of Roman Shadow? This is the moment. I feel like hell, but I'll make it. I think I'm the only person who believes I'm gonna win, but... Oh, stop with that. What? Nobody believes in me. Everyone thinks Roman's gonna win, blah, blah, blah. Honestly, it's exhausting. Wow. Stiff. Seriously, how are you still dealing with imposter syndrome after three plus years as champion? I mean, I guess I just... You're so used to people doubting you that you won't let them believe in you. Woods, Rollins, Rhodes, Lesnar, you beat everyone who came for that belt, while Roman, holy art thou reigns, was sipping organic smoothies in an air-conditioned trailer. <laughs> I'm right, though. You might not feel like it, but you're not the dark horse anymore. You're the... the horse that people expect to win. The favorite? That's right. You're the favorite. So go out there and prove all of us right. <laughs>